Hello all. Uh, this video is going to talk about something that's uh, really easy to do in your Ubuntu install. Um, if you don't like Unity and you don't really like the direction GNOME shell is going, uh, you still have the option to install GNOME Panel, which is more like the uh, GNOME 2. So we'll just open Software Center, and all you do is uh, zoom in here and just type in GNOME and a dash panel. There it is. GNOME panel. Any more information if you want, take a look. Um, you can add these in if you wish, these two, email and the web browser. But uh, I'm just going to install it. You type in your password, administrative password, and uh, it will download the, what, what's needed, dependencies. Um, one thing you have to do, though, is when you're finished, is you have to restart. Don't just log out. Uh, make sure you restart. So that's what I'm going to do. When this is uh, finished installing, um, I'll be back, and I'll log into, I'll be logged into GNOME Panel. So here you are, back at the uh, uh, GNOME installation, and this time it's in the classic look of GNOME 2. Uh, it's called Fallback Mode. Uh, it's not called Classic, it's called Fallback. It's got most of GNOME 2's attributes. Uh, when you want to add something, you hold the Windows key and the Alt key, and right-click and Add to Panel, and you have a list of different things. And that's nice to see a custom launcher. Um, I missed that in uh, Unity Desktop. Uh, but there's a whole bunch of stuff. So you can add your own. You can take like... Uh, no, where is it? Uh, Google. Drag them up there. And you can add something like weather. Add. Give it a second to refresh, if it ever does. But you get the idea. Show desktop again, which is down at the bottom. Um, now what I did is I opted to, uh, there it is, except for New York time, you're close enough. So there's weather, and you can, you know, have your applications up here if you want. Um, properties, you can resize it, auto-expand, auto-hide. Uh, sh show hide buttons to, for moving. So it's pretty close. Uh, I have this uh, running in a virtual machine, and uh, when you install this, you have to click this here. Now its default is Ubuntu, the Unity. There's GNOME fallback, no effects. That's what I'm in now, or just GNOME fallback. So no effects. With any luck, uh, it'll be logged in just like you would here. Yeah, same idea. Add to panel. So that's a uh, GNOME panel, uh, GNOME fallback. And so you have more of a traditional uh, desktop experience, I guess. Uh, Bunchu software, everything's still there. But uh, you can, you know, if you're used to this and you want to stick with this, then you can, and you still run the latest version of Ubuntu, which is uh, version 13.04 as of this recording. Okay, so that's it for this one. I think it's pretty straightforward. And thanks so much for watching, and we'll talk to you soon. Bye for now.